Yeah. My glasses are dirty. That's not my problem. It is, what is today, 29th? Yes. It's 11 ish, 11 30 ish. October 29th. October 29th. It's supposed to be like 65 We're today. The rest of the stuff off our boat. We don't have very far to drive in, and it wasn't very hard to find it. So, it's not indoors right now because we're going to have them do new bellows and shift cables on the drives. And so, they're going to put it in the shop. Yeah, they, they... asked if they could leave it out for a little while. I'm like, yeah, it sits outside all, all year anyway. So. so, it's out for just a little while. Once they get all the boats in, they're putting ours in the shop. And then, uh, we're going to pull both of the out drives and... The bellows are the the rubber boots. They go around the drive shaft and the water input and stuff like that. And they get dry rotted and cracked over time. So it's preventative it maintenance. Cracks, water can get inside the boat and then your boat sinks. So it's like you want to maintenance things. We don't do we it. don't want one of that we don't want that problem. No, we're getting that done this year. But, uh, we're gonna have them scuff our uh, bottom paint too and redo that and then uh, before we retire and move up to Michigan we're gonna do a total strip and start from scratch yeah, yeah. considering she's been sitting outside for multiple weeks so We have to figure out how to, we have to figure out something in that. Ugh. Yeah, we gotta figure out something for that corner. Anyways. Good? she is so in our winterizing process we're obviously pulling all the the rest of the liquids the cleaning supplies but John's got this box of bounce and every boat we've had uh, we learned this somewhere you just throw these bounce sheets everywhere tuck them in places I think she's being silly now I am I need some silliness in my life right now. And really, uh, you never, no spiders, no mice, nothing comes in. So we'll like spread this entire thing and it keeps it smelling fresh. Yep. So all the batteries are pulled, all the, all the remotes that are here, uh, we pull all the batteries, the lights, the O2 sensors, batteries we're gonna pull a fuse again um yeah that's it Rentners does a great job on, on winterizing everything for us the uh can't say enough good things about them oh something else jen did this year see the bags back there she got these vacuum seal bags yep. everything and she those get those have all of her pillows i have a small small collection oh say a dozen yes i said a dozen pillows on board the pillows are in there blankets sheets right no sheets are at home because they gotta get washed okay but but like the little my decorative stuff decorative blankets and stuff like that they're all tucked tucked away back there all of our coats so, that we keep on here oh those are gone too yep 
Because, yeah, yeah, usually that... All, that of our, all of our towels have been washed and vacuum sealed. Oh, cool. So... Yeah, we usually keep that closet full of uh, jackets. Can you, I don't know. White, can you open it? Some, no, it's got... Stuff yeah, lightweight jackets and stuff like that, just for those cool evenings, especially when we go early. I can open it a little bit. Oh, <laughs> look, she's got everything vacuum sealed and stuck in there. Hold you. Nice. Yep, so this is our winterizing process. Our. Hi. Hers. <sighs> And then when we go back in next year, we'll, she pulls everything. It's been it, three weeks looking for fabric softener sheets. She'll pull all these dishes and stuff and wash them off. Just it's not like they get, things get dusty. dirty. They just get you know a little dust from sitting. Oh. Yep. That is about it, I think. Oh, I still got the batteries hooked up, so I had to pop the hatch. Look at the motors one last time. One last time for now. And that's it, short and, short and sweet. Grab some stuff, check things out. We're out of here. They filled up really nice. Oh, you got one in the sling, huh? Cool.